Please stand for the Pledge of Allegiance. Ready, begin. Pledge of Allegiance to the flag of the United States of America, to the Republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. You may be seated. Today is Wednesday, March 23rd, and it's Haziel's birthday. Happy birthday, Hazi. Thank you. This what is, this? is your Raja report. That's a ding. And I'm Mr. Jackson, who has to be here because it's his birthday. Let's begin today's show with some quick announcements from Mrs. Druyan. Good morning, Rajas. I'm here to speak to you about three different things this morning. The first thing has to do with your course requests for next school year. Believe it or not, we're already working on the master schedule and all of the courses for the 22-23 school year. The counselors have been collecting your course requests since the end of January. So now, at this point, if you are a student who would like to consider adding an honors, advanced placement, or specialty course to your course requests for next year, you have until Friday, April 8th to do so. Please make sure that you have the proper signatures on a course request sheet before going to your counselor to turn those in. Keep in mind the window closes Friday, April 8th. The second announcement I have to go over information with today has to do with perfect attendance. At the end of the year, we recognize students who have achieved perfect attendance for the school year, both at the end of the year awards and our graduation ceremony. For the purpose of these awards, we define perfect attendance as no tardies, and no absences from class, excused or unexcused. So the only exception to that is if a student was on an out list for a school sponsored event, then that would not count against the student for perfect attendance. If you believe that you are a student who has achieved perfect attendance for this school year, you need to email me by this Friday, March 25th. I will verify with the attendance office whether or not you have perfect attendance and respond to you accordingly. Please email me at amy.druyan at desertsands.us. Students also received an email yesterday afternoon with the same information. And last, but certainly not least, I'd like to talk to you about the prom for this year, the end of the school year. The class of 23 juniors and the officers have been hard at work planning prom for this year all year long. Keep in mind, this is gonna be the first prom that our students can attend since 2019. It's sure to be an event that you won't wanna miss. Couple of pieces of information. Juniors and seniors are allowed to attend prom. Guests, and we encourage all of our students who are attending prom to bring a guest. Guests can be a freshman or sophomore at Indio High School. Additionally, guests can be non-Indio High School students. The district has now allowed us to revert back to our policies regarding non-Indio High School students at dances to what we had in place prior to COVID. One thing to remember, any student who is on the exclusion list will not be allowed to attend prom, no matter what their grade level is. So if you find that you are on the exclusion list and you are planning on attending prom, it is very important that you meet with Mr. Pimentel and to do community service time so that you can get yourself off of the exclusion list if you're interested in attending prom. Now, just a reminder, any non-Indio High School student will also need to go through the guest pass procedures. More information will be coming regarding that it's definitely gonna be an event you don't wanna miss and we look forward to seeing everybody there. Thank you and have a great day.
There will be a special training for any students interested in being a part of the Teenage Suicide Awareness and Prevention Program. This training comes to us from the Riverside University Health Systems. Come learn and come learn how you can support your friends and classmates by recognizing signs and being informed about available resources. The training will be today and tomorrow, right after school, in room 3112. If you have any questions, please see Ms. Martinez in the activities office. This Mother's Day, celebrate mom or a mom-like person in your life. Each apron is individually crafted by a local artisan who also happens to be a Raja parent. Each apron is $20 and comes in one size. There are three designs to choose from, Tea Time, Floral Fun, and Polka Blue. Each apron will be individually wrapped and will come with a card. Scan the QR code to get your orders in by Friday, April 1st. There's no fooling you. Don't delay. Show mom some love this Mother's Day. Renaissance will be having a talent show this Friday, March 25th, in the gym from 6 p.m. to 8 p.m. The cost is $3 with the Indio High School ASB card and $5 without an ASB card. FFA is now selling their very own socks for only $15 a pair. Keep your feet warm during the cold nights that are very common here in the desert and buy a sock or two with goats, pigs, steers, etc. Contact one of these FFA officers or stop by room 803 or 808 for any info or to purchase. Congratulations to the following staff members for receiving Staff of the Month for the month of February. For the 9th grade, it's Mr. Murray, 10th grade, Mr. Machado, 11th grade, Mrs. Long, and 12th grade, Mr. Keith Jackson. And non-teaching staff member goes to Mr. Gomez. Voting is still going on to choose your Staff Member of the Month for the month of March. Math Club shirts are here. They are $10 each. Please pay for them in the activities and pick them up in room 7204. Are you going to prom but need to find that perfect dress? Well, mark your calendars for Friday, April 1st from 2.30 to 7.30. On April 1st, the Indio Teen Center will be giving away prom dresses for free. There are hundreds of dresses to try on and to choose from, so come and find your dream dress. See you there on April 1st from 2.20 to 7.30 p.m. at the Indio Teen Center, and happy shopping. Join the IHS dance team. Auditions are April 5th, 6th, and 7th after school in the dance room. You must attend all three days of auditions. If you're interested, contact Angela Gallegos at DesertSands.us. Parent meetings for dance will also be held on March 28th and April 4th. Renaissance is having their monthly bake sale today bef before school in front of the office and after school in front of the lecture hall. Each item is $1. And now for sports. And I'm Alonzo, and welcome back to Rajah Sports. Sports! Let's get right into it. Rajah baseball team is back in act. Wait, what? No. Rajah baseball team has a game on Friday against Desert Mirage away. Medicineers will play a home game today against Cat City at 3.30. Come and support. Softball team will play on Friday away against Desert Mirage. They also beat Desert Mirage yesterday, what was it, 15 to 1. They <laughs> That's... <laughs> I'm sorry. Softball beat Desert Mirage 15 to 1, and they will play on Friday again in an away game. And lastly, the swim team will be having a swim meet tomorrow after school. That's all for sports, and now for weather. Good morning, Rajas. I'm Ramon, and here's today's and tomorrow's forecast. Today, we can expect a high of 87 with a low of 53 with sunny skies for the whole day. Tomorrow, we can expect a high of 94 with a low of 62 with sunny skies for the whole day. No rain or snow is expected, like always. 
but we for sure have high temperatures with the highest of being 99 for Saturday. That's it for today's forecast, and now back to the anchor desk. And with that, we want to leave you with something to remember. You are seen, you are loved, and you are part of this Raja community. Don't forget to show some Raja pride, positivity, respect, integrity, determination, and excellence. And now it's time for... The Joke of the Day! All right, I have another bad joke for you guys. Are you ready? Yeah. All right, why is Aerosmith a good motivator? Why is Aerosmith a good motivator? Because they tell you to dream on, dream on, <laughs> dream on, dream until you dream <laughs> That's all for today. Remember, be kind to one another and stay classy, Indio. I'm Haziel. And C, si, yo soy Emo. Signing off for the Raja Report. Okay. Right. Yeah, Jackson! <laughs>